Would you rather bomb a church or a mosque? That's nuts, but I'm Christian, bro. Like, I have to say mosque, bro. That's not. I know that sounds nuts, bro. Is it? Is that? It's gonna be nuts either way. But I have to say, I'm Christian in it, so I have to say mosque. All right, all right. So, um, what are your opinion on Muslims? <laughs> That's actually mad. What a mad question. Uh, would you Would you rather bomb a church or a mosque? What? Would you rather bomb Neither. a church or a mosque? Neither. Neither. Oh, okay. You I'm have to choose, guys. I'm not choosing. I'm not choosing. Okay. Here, hold on. I got one. Wasn't that the last question? <laughs> Sorry. <coughs> um, excuse me. Excuse me. Uh, do you mind if I ask you a couple questions for a YouTube video? Sure, I've only got a few minutes. Is that long? A few minutes. Uh, no, no, it'll be very quick. If you had to choose, what race would you eliminate from Earth? Probably white people. <laughs> Why white people? Too stuck up. Too stuck up. All right, that's respectable. Yeah. Well, yeah, yeah. I just realised you're eliminating your own race. Yeah. Bro, you're going to disappear from the Earth. That's a bit like on uh, Avengers, you know, just click the finger and off we go. <laughs> All right, fair enough. Uh, so you had a question. What's your question? Me. Um. What are your thoughts and opinions on Al Qaeda? Thoughts and opinions on Al Qaeda. Well, I don't really <laughs> follow the news a whole lot. Um, you know who Al Qaeda is? Yeah, it's it's like a uh, yeah, like a terrorist group. Um, well, obviously, doing harm to other people is is not good. So, yeah, huh. all Muslims are like that. No. I've got, I've got a question. Would you like to answer this question? If it's quick. Okay. okay. What religion are terrorists? Every religion, every person, everyone has negative thoughts some days. It's just the people that act on the negative thoughts that discriminate against other people. So it really depends. You're good at answering these questions, you know, avoiding getting cancelled and everything. You know. Thank you for your time. Bro. I appreciate it. Have a nice day. If you're comfortable, what's your name? Enrique. Okay, let's start with the questions. Rate yourself one to ten. I'm a nine. A nine. <laughs> confident. Confident. Yeah. Right. So what do you think you could improve about yourself? Why are you not a ten? Uh, don't know, bro. There's always stuff to improve about yourself. No one's perfect, innit? Yeah. I can't pick out a certain thing, but there's always stuff to improve on, innit? That's respectable, respectable. Okay, let's get into the real questions, the real questions. Would you rather bomb a church or a mosque? That's nuts, but I'm Christian, bro. Like, I have to say mosque, bro. That's not. I know that sounds nuts, bro. Is it, is that, it's going to be nuts either way, but I have to say I'm Christian, innit? So I have to say mosque. All right, all right. So, um, what are your opinion on Muslims? <laughs> That's actually mad. What a mad question. <laughs> bro, bro, listen. I grew up in London, innit? Like, I grew up in a very multicultural borough. Like, my parents aren't... My parents are immigrants, so, like... Bro, I, I love everyone for who they are, and I don't, I'm not discriminative against anyone. Right. Well said, well said. Okay, so, um, you said your parents are immigrants. Yeah, yeah. Well, where are your parents from, then? They're Brazilian. Brazilian? Yeah, yeah. Right. So, you know you know a bit of Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu? No, 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 I don't, do, I don't do that, bro. I just play football, innit? <laughs> All right, play football, play football. Yeah, okay, let's move on to the questions. Uh, so this phone actually turned off, so I can't see the questions anymore. Okay. But, off the top of my head, yeah. do you think the beauty standards for men and women over time have uh, been increased or gone down? Um, probably, I don't know, but probably increased, isn't it? I'm not even sure, but that's a hard question. I think, do you know what, back in the day, where you had like, m like people like Marilyn Monroe and all those women, where they had to be like a certain... Like you know, a certain way to like to be perceived as beautiful, and now like nowadays you have like people like Kim Kardashian and stuff like that who are perceived as beautiful. So I think they just switched, but they've stayed the same kind of in in a, in a way. But they've just switched beauty standards. Uh, don't mind my bin bags, by the way. That's actually bare awkward. Uh, and, and and for men, I don't know. Like for men, I have no idea what the beauty standards are for men, bro. Like I, th I think it's probably the same. Like big strong men are probably perceived more beautiful. Yeah. 
So um, just to clarify, and please correct me if I'm wrong, so you're saying for women now that you know, plastic surgery is available and all of that, the standards have increased? Yeah, yeah. Uh, I would say the standards have changed. I don't know if they've increased. Like I think, like, like I said, like obviously back in the day didn't didn't have that, so the standards were different. And now they're plastic surgery. I feel like the, the standards haven't increased, but they've changed to a different standard. Yeah, so basically the standards have changed into bigger ass, bigger tits. Yeah, basically, yeah. Faker, yeah, just right. faker everything, I think. So, in my opinion, increased, but... Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, I don't know. All right, all right, all right. So... Um, do you think the beauty standards are higher for men or women then? Uh, probably women, 100%. Women. Yeah, because I think I think men can still be ugly and have money, and uh, and women just can you know they have to look a certain way to be attractive. Do you think that's fair? No, of course not. Of course it's not fair, but of course it's not fair. But it's just, that's just how life is, isn't it? That's just how the world works. Why why is it not fair? Because why 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 should a, a woman be judged on their appearance? Um, but then, then I can say the same thing for men. Like, why should men be judged on how much money they have? So it's it's a bit of a weird one, isn't it? I think I think a lot of focus now is put onto those kind of things instead of like actual love and like actual relationships, like all of that stuff. Okay, final question. Yeah. What is your opinion on Andrew Tate? Andrew Tate. We're trying to get trending. We're trying to get trending. <laughs> That's nuts, bro. I don't. Know. Do you know? What? I, I watch I watch his bald head all the time in TikTok, bro. I don't really rate him to be honest. Like, I think he chats a load of rubbish, but he's funny. Like. Yeah. <laughs> Oh yeah, you got the same bald head as well. <laughs> Alright, that's nuts. Um, no, bro, honestly, I don't rate him at all. I think I think he's a massive dickhead. Yeah. As what? You don't agree with the stuff he says? Uh, I, I don't agree with the stuff he says. I think I think so, like some of the stuff he says is calm. Like uh, the things I could say those things as well. Like anyone could say those things, but the the misogynistic stuff is just mm, ridiculous. And hey, I don't rate. Give us one example of something misogynistic he said. Uh, bro, off the top of my head, I can't remember. On a real thing, I can't. But uh, I, I've just always heard it on TikTok. So, yeah. Don't you think it's a little bit unfair to judge somebody just based on what people put of them on TikTok rather than actually watching what they decide to put on the internet? Of course, of course not. But I've, I have watched some of the stuff he's put on the internet. And I don't rate it still. It's, it's, it's not about what on TikTok. Like, obviously, like, yeah, it's very like you can choose any anything that anyone says ever and put it on TikTok and make it look bad. But it's like some of the stuff that he actually posts and what well, posted because he obviously is banned on it. So I, I just didn't rate, and I just don't rate his whole like ethos and his whole the way of the, the, his whole being. All right, that's fair enough. All right. All right, have a nice day. Thanks for the interview, man. You. Had some good answers in there. Thank you, thank you. All right, see you. So it's going to start off easy, you know. What did you have for breakfast today? I didn't have breakfast today at all. <laughs> what about lunch? This is going to be my lunch, so that's great. Yeah, that's nice, that's nice. Cool. Okay, so um, over time, do you think beauty standards have increased or decreased? I think that beauty standards now are, like, so terrible, especially for women, because the bar is, like, so high but like for men it's always at the floor so you know it's a bit 50 50 on that one for me you know right. it's like what what are you gonna do you know for girls you're gonna make sure that they look like models but guys you know you can go around looking like a homeless man you know no but for a guy you have to be tall like nobody's gonna date like a five foot guy realistically i mean if he's got good personality yes that is literally like key you know all right okay so. Fair enough, fair enough. I guess it. <laughs> thank you, thank you. But, uh, we don't have a lot of budget right now. Not <laughs> the budget, it's fine. Uh, Alright, second question. Yeah. So I guess you've already answered this. So uh, I was going to ask, um, do you think the beauty standards for men or women are higher? But it's women, right? Yeah, for women are usually a lot higher. Like especially now, we're trying to like make sure that people remember we're real people too. But you know, people always forget that for some reason. You know. Alright. Oh, fair enough. Okay, next question. Now, if you had to choose, yeah. so you're being forced to choose, would you rather bomb a mosque or a church? What? <laughs> church, no question. A church? Church, no question. Why a church? Have you seen the stuff that priests pull? Like, have you seen the stuff that Christianity has pulled over the years? Okay, what if it's a black church? No. No, you can't do that. So, no. so <laughs> If it's a black church, would you bomb a mosque? Oh no, I wouldn't bomb anything, what? You're being forced. <laughs> oh, I'm not doing it, I'm sorry. I'm bombing me, I'm exploding. I'm sorry, I'm not doing it. Alright, respectable, respectable. Okay, we have one last question. What do you think of Andrew Tate? What? Sorry, it's disgusting. I, I don't like him, no. He is literally everything wrong with toxic masculinity and like guys, you know. 
and like the standards that they have for women, he's everything wrong with that. Okay, so um, give me one example of something Andrew Tate said that you don't agree with. That um, I think he was like, women are responsible for like assault, you know, in the way that they're dressed um, and all kinds of stuff like that, you know, and I was like, that's disgusting, man. That's right. absolutely disgusting. Alright, that's reasonable. I can understand why you wouldn't agree with that. Now, what if I were to tell you that we actually have Andrew Tate right there? Right there, behind you. Yeah, he's obviously right there. That's Do the long day, day, day. Day. <laughs> Yeah, I would be like, fuck you, thank you very much. You are absolutely horrible. Thank you. Alright, thank you. Have a nice day. You also have like the shaved head, like Andrew Tate. Yeah, I, I did it to become like Andrew Tate. I can't, I can't lie. Well, first of all, would you rate the mic? The, the mic, yeah, the mic. The cell, the cell's fire. Right. Okay, so let's just like start, start with a nice one. Uh, what would you have for breakfast? For breakfast, I forgot. You forgot? I forgot. Oh, okay, that's, that's, that's good. Are you doing it as well? What yeah, do you yeah. have for breakfast? Uh, chicken and watermelon. Chicken. Uh, and chicken. Right, okay. Alright, so hit a cheeky one. How much do you care about your social image? Uh huh. Like how people see you, how much do you care about that? Um, decent amount. Yeah, decent amount, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. okay. So you're not beauty standards, are you? Yeah, no. obviously. You don't ask that. How are you doing? Oh, so you yeah. that? It's like, Is that like a food? Standard. Yeah. <laughs>
Oh, that's not a race. Oh, no, you've got the Indians. Race, race. Indians, black, white, Morocco Asians. Morocco is a race. Morocco is a race. Asians. Oh, right. The Indians at the bottom. Okay. 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 Latinos. Nice. Of, the, of the first. Okay, okay. I say this is. Uh, wait, what was the other ones? Like Latino. Uh, Indian. White Asian. White yeah. Asian. I say, yeah, yeah. What are we talking 10 out of 10s or just like. They're all 10, 10, out, of 10. 10 out of 10s. Yeah. Latino, Asian. What are you thinking of that guy there? Right, let him finish, let him finish. Uh, yeah, so Latino, Asian. Okay. Black and white's pretty close. Black and white is pretty, you, you pretty close. Us? Yeah, yeah, you can't. Oh. Yeah, black and white's close, right? Okay, I say, I say white, black, Indian. Ah, uh, fuck Morocco. Fuck you. Oh. We're Moroccan. You're crazy. <laughs> gonna fight? I'll fight right now. Oh. Yeah. And hello, thank you guys for making it this far. Um, make sure you check out part two. It gets crazy there. Thomas and two people had an argument about whether being fat was unhealthy, and uh, yeah, the two people got pretty mad. So um. Yeah, make sure you check out part two. It should be out by the time you finish watching this video. Make sure you like and subscribe because we need all the support.